It's good because I'm a little bit more rehearsed this time as well. <laughs> How often, if ever, do you use makeup? Um, not as much as I did last year. Um, <laughs> I'm just doing this all again. Last year, I um, I wear quite a lot of makeup on nights out and stuff, like a bit of eyeliner and loads of glitter and stuff. And um, I also religiously painted my nails as well, which I haven't done for quite a long time. I'm not sure why, it's just just one of those things, but I used to wear it quite a lot. What are your thoughts on society and your makeup? I think there is too much, like, it's it's too much of a big deal when it doesn't have to be. It's literally people do it because they want to do it. Mm. And for some reason that's been taken, like, way out of proportion. Uh, how do you personally view men who wear makeup? I think they're really cool. <laughs> um, have you found that masculine women are accepted in society and feminine men are not? I... See, that was the question I struggled with last time. I think, I think, um, I think feminine men are kind... Like, they're like... Because when, when I think of people like Alan Carr and Paul O'Grady and Graham Norton, I think of how popular they are because of the way they act. So people do like the whole feminine man thing. And I feel like masculine women get quite a lot of stick just because of, like, I don't know, just from what I've seen online and stuff and the way they're treated. Yeah. Um, why do you think men who choose to wear makeup particularly look down upon in society? Because it, um, because it messes with people's preconceptions of what makeup's supposed to be for. Because it's so heavily marketed towards women, anyone who disrupts that, like, generally make people feel uncomfortable, which is really ridiculous. Uh, what can we do to help feminine men be more accepted in society? I think just just make them feel a bit more comfortable. When like when I used to go out, I'd get so many people asking me stupid questions about it, like, you know, why, what's the point? It's for girls. And it it's like it's although it's like an opportunity to kind of educate people a bit more, it's still like it puts you in a position and makes you feel quite uncomfortable. So just let people do what they do without you know, without having to question it or Interrupt it. Just, just let it happen. Yeah. Thank you. No problem, man. <laughs>